Hey everybody, what's up? This is T Player. Today I'm going to show you how to put together your rear seat cowl. I kind of thought this was an easy process until I opened the box and um, looked at it because I thought the thing was going to come put together, but it didn't. So I'm going to show you how to put it together. As you can see, this is the box it comes in, and this box is huge compared to what's inside of it. You got your instructions in Japanese and English. Um, this should take about five minutes at the most. It took me about 30 minutes because I was trying to look at the directions and look at the diagrams and read and of course I had the TV on also so it took me like 30 minutes to put the thing together. But I'm going to show you how to do it in five minutes or less. So you take it out the box. You got your parts here. You got two screws, two grommets, and two metal clips, and this bar. It's very simple. So you take your seat cowl, whatever color you got, and you take your back piece. And this back piece has like little nipples on it. So when you slide it into these holes, slide it in, and you turn it over, all you do is pull on them, and it locks, it locks the back piece into place. I'm get all of them. There we go, that one, that one, that one. And so, now your back plate is in place. Next we can do, you take these clips, and it's got a raised side where the bolt goes through the nut, and it's got a flush side. So we're just gonna slide that with the flush side facing up. One, and one on this side. Two. So, we, so now we've slid our um, brackets into place. You've got two size of grommets. Big and small. That's what I call them. Small ones go in the back. Once again, there's a little lip in there. Just slide it in the hole till it gets in there. I do the twisting motion. Right there. Now it's time to put the metal bracket on. You've got this bracket, metal plate, and it's got a little indentation here that's going to match up with this little indentation there. There's only one way this can go on. There's no way you can screw this up. So put that on. Take your two screws. Screw them into each side. Now wrench them down tight. Later. Take your bigger grommets. Put them in these holes right here. Just twist them in. They're going to go right in. And there you have it. It's done. Your sea cowl is now done. Now it's ready to go on your bike. There's one more piece that's going to go on your bike. And there's a rubber grommet that goes in the hole on your bike. And it holds this piece insecure. So I'll show you that. So now I'm ready to take off my seat. Use your key, pop your seat up, take your key out because you got to slide your seat forward to get it from under that hook back there. That comes off. Now you're ready to put your seat collar on. You're going to have to do some fitting. But what I want to show you is the rubber grommet. And that's this piece right here. This piece right here. You just slide that in there and, I mean, everybody knows how to put a rubber grommet in. So you just put it in there. It's got a lip in it also. The bottom half of the grommet goes on the bottom half. This top goes on the top half of this bar. And you, this piece right there is going to sit down in that hole. So now, <clears throat> just line that piece up with this hole. It's going to sit kind of far back. And get your front piece lined up. I mean, you can 
squat down and visually slide it up, but I know where it is because I messed with it. And you just snap it on. And there you go. Your seat cowl's in place. So now that that's on, I think I'm just going to go ahead and put my um, tank guard on that I bought. So let's do that. So I got this tank guard that I want to put on my uh, bike. And uh, reading the directions, it says to uh, clean my area, which I've already cleaned it before. Kind of hit the camera here. I'm just going to gloss over it once again. Dry it up, make sure it's good. So after you've cleaned the area where it's going to go, take a few minutes to decide exactly where you want it to be. Yeah, right about there. That looks good to me right there. I just got a simple one piece because I wanted it to be kind of easy for me to put on. I don't want to have to line up two pieces. That looks just about. It's just, that is perfect. I'm just going to squeeze all the air out from underneath and there we have it. <laughs> 